Bridge. This is in Niagara Falls. That bridge is located less than a mile from the famous waterfalls. Uh, federal officials are investigating the situation. We can see um, local, state, and federal officials there on the scene. Witnesses say the car was swerving erratically near a border checkpoint. New York Governor Kathy Hochul says local, state, and federal resources are all investigating what exactly took place a short time ago. We understand the Ontario Provincial Police Highway Safety Division, uh, of course, that's on the Canadian side, provided this update on social media. You can expect heavy delays in the Niagara area. If you are planning on crossing the border, please uh, delay travel until we know those highways and uh, closures have reopened. A very important announcement right now. Officials are increasing security in the area in the wake of this. Cars heading to Buffalo Airport are undergoing additional security checks and other travelers can expect additional screenings, we're told. And of course, this is happening on the day before Thanksgiving, one of the busiest travel days of the year. Uh, we are continuing to gather information from the scene. We're going to follow these updates and bring you more information as it becomes available. All right, at this moment, we are less than a day away from the beginning of a temporary ceasefire in the Middle East. Late last night, Israel and Hamas came to terms on a hostage release deal. The ceasefire is set to begin at 10 a.m. local time tomorrow. That's 3 a.m. Eastern time. And here are the details. This 